Hi everyone! In this tutorial, I will show you how to remove people and moving objects from a video clip in just a few clicks using Adobe After Effects. In the first example, I will remove this person from the video. As you can see, just after he leaves the frame, another man is partly visible on the edge, so I'll get rid of him too. The first step is to create a mask around the area we want to remove. Make sure the video is selected and then add the mask. It doesn't have to be very precise in this case because there's no overlapping moving parts. So I just choose a rectangle mask. To see the whole image instead of just the mask area, you can change the mode to none. Now click on the stopwatch to create the first keyframe for the mask. Then go through the clip to create a few other keyframes and move the mask accordingly. Since I want to remove this man at the edge, I will leave the mask around here. Check if the mask covers everything in each single frame and then make some adjustments if necessary. Set the mask mode to subtract again. The second step is to use the Content Aware Fill. If you don't see the panel, select it in the Window menu. Make sure the Fill method is set to Object. The Alpha Expansion option expands the area to be filled, so it just adds a few pixels around the mask. In this case, the mask is quite big, so it doesn't really matter, but I often leave it to around 20. And then click on Generate Fill Layer. If your project has not been saved yet, you will have to do it. And then After Effects proceeds with the content film. It can take from a few seconds to a few minutes, depending on the clip. As you can see, the fill layer contains the new content. Let's do the same with another clip, this time using the pen tool to create the mask instead of the rectangle. In this clip, I will limit the work area to the time when the cyclist passes in front of the camera, and I will render just that part. There is an error message here saying that there is nothing to fill. And that's because the mask mode is still set to none. I have to set it back to subtract. Outside of the work area, the mask is still visible because I didn't generate the content fill for those frames. What I could do is simply move the mask out of the frame or remove it. I will just select it and press the delete key because I don't need it anymore. And this is the last example of a clip I edited using the same method. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it and learned something, please click on the like button. Comment if you have any feedback or questions and please subscribe to my channel.